Right, everyone, I'm back. Now I'm going to show you what I've been doing. I used this. It's just the lid off a tube. And I make hair bits. Um, so that bit goes round there. So I'm just seeing if you can see. See like that. So that can be... When you bring it back like that, you can see it's the front of the hair. And it's easy to peel off of this using hot glue. So that is the... I'll show you on the doll. Let me just take the head off. It's just easier. So what this happens, uh, or what happens with this, it gets glued on that way. Like that. But, you know, you can put it above the eye, uh, the ears. And then you can bring it back however you want to do it. See, like that. So if I don't want it as far forward as that, I can lift that up. And then we end up with that. Because I can twist all of this, you know, and bring it back. Let me just do that. So we can twist this and bring that over there. And then we can twist this. You know, we can... We can do stuff like this with our hair. So you can do all sorts. And you don't see the join. Because you glue that bit down. But in order to do that, then you also need the back piece as well. So I do this and I put that above the head like that at the back um, I just have to do another one that goes here that will sit on top of that so I'm going to share that with you now um, I've got these that I'm using I'm using three different colours to be honest and you can just bear with me. I do cut them first. Just use my small... See, that's partly got some ready. And I just cut a layer. Like that. And leave that there. And then this one. You might do yours differently. This is how I do mine. I'm just going to bring that off in layers like that. Obviously, I'm going to do this one as well. Just bring that off in pieces like that. I will end up using all of this. Peel it back, lay it on top. Like that. And then you only take off the bits you need. There, now we've finished with that. So I will be using all of that. Uh, that. That one's ready to peel back. And then I'm going to add some of this in as well. I'm just going to get that ready. Okay, there we are. So we're using the three there. I hope you can see this. Now, I just take the glue gun. Now, you can hold it, you see, while you're working with it. So you just start to glue it. Uh, where's my little finger dobber? Sorry, I had a thing. Here it is. You do need something because it can be hot. Now I'm just going to start and layer this. I lay it on and dob it down. I might have left that a little bit too much, uh, too long. So pull it back. And then just dob that down. You're going to cut the excess off. Now you only want a small patch at the back of the head. Like 
take that off what you don't need just going to put a little bit more on just go over it now where are we? just going to bring some of this onto there hold that down like that A little bit here. That's why I like to take it off first. I'm just going to mix this with a little bit of this. Sorry, I hope you're seeing this. And put some over here as well. We'll break some of this off. You yeah, bring that down a little bit. Just keep doing that. And then you take your scissors, of course, and you just trim the edge so it's all even. Get rid of the excess so it ends up quite neat like that and then when you're ready you just peel that off and it peels pretty clean I'm saying that and look it's not going to peel clean now <laughs> and there you go you've got your hair piece now, I'm just going to leave that there because I do want to build on it and I don't want to disturb that one either. Keep that one like that. So, um, where have I put a head? There she is. I actually need a head on. No, I'm going to do the eyes. I'm just going to move that out of the way. We will need that because you use that to uh, titivate up and check everything's okay. See? <laughs> so there's a hair piece is ready and that can be moved out of the way. Now, you need to take um, a pretty sharp knife if you've got one and I'm not sure mine are that sharp. Now, I'm going to go into it like that. I'm not going to go straight down because I want this to fit back on there when I've done the eyes. So I'm just going to go round the circle.
done it. Yeah. Oh, her earrings come off. Never mind. We can glue that back on. That's not a problem. So I need to get rid of those bits. Um, I just want to check those eyes. I'm just going to... I need something to put them in with. Let me just check these eyes. Oh look, it fits. How wonderful is that? But look, she's gonna have two colored, two different colored eyes. Are they this, the different colors? One's blue, one's green. <laughs> and that's not, I need the both the same. Oh yes, fun, shut up. Now, let me just see if I can get... Oh, but look! Now, would it matter if she had two different colour eyes? I can't, I've only got one of each. Would it matter? You could have one of each, couldn't you? You know what, I think for this doll I'll just leave as is. <laughs> We've got our eyes in. Now we can move them so you can have them now like looking one way. But I think we'll just keep them in like that. And I can drop some glue in there. But look, see? And then what I need to do is to get the head back. So I've got some glossy accents. I'm going to do it and just leave it as is. It doesn't really matter that she's going to have two different colour eyes. It don't matter. I'm not fussed. It just saves me making them, that's all. But I will show you how to do them. And just gluing the back of the eye onto this, you know, this skin at the back. So, and for that, I just need a little, like a stick of some sort. So I'm just going to use one of these and cut this off, cut the point off. And then just use that to move the glue about. And that will hold, it's glossy accent, so it'll hold stiff. So when that's dry, that will hold those eyes in. I ain't bothered about them being different colours, to be honest. I really aren't. Uh, I think that's fun. <laughs> oh, fun. So, what I'm going to do, I'm going to glue this back in. Now, the hole goes to the top, as we know. And we just put that, turn it around till it goes back in. You're not going to see that when the hair's on. Just holding that in. Yeah, I'm, I'm all right with that. So what I'm going to do now is to put some eyelashes on. I bought normal false eyelashes. And I do need to put them on with glossy accents. Oops. Where's it gone? Hang on. I'll just get another one off. Sorry, it is really... Ugh, I keep dropping them. Mm. 
Not a bit more. Right, good morning folks. Sorry I've not been with you for a few days. I actually took a break. Um, I just needed some time out. I'd been working really long hours and uh, I had to take some time for myself. <laughs> you get like that sometimes. Uh, now we're back on lockdown. My God, when will it end, eh? Right, so I have filmed, which this will be on uh, attached to the first film when I've done her eyes. Now, as you can see, she has one blue and one green eye. And they're the only two eyes I had. But I'm not bothered about her having two different colour eyes. I kind of like it. And I've also popped on the eyelashes. So I've shown you how to do that. I'm not sure if I'm going to cut them. Well, do you know what? I might just cut, but I'm going to do them at a, an angle. And just start trimming them down. Maybe like that. <laughs> yes, I like that. So I'm just going to do the same with this as well. <clears throat> now, let me just get this straight. Yeah, that's it. Yes, I like them. I like them like that. That'll do me. <laughs> and she looks really pretty with them on. Now, your, eye, your eyelashes you can do as you like, but I've shown you how to do them. So, um, the next thing is the hair. Now, I'm just going to show something with the hair. You might do it totally different to me. But, oh, sorry, I might need her again. There are ways and means of doing the hair. Now, I make the hair up into sections first. And I have two. I've got this one here. that I'm, I'm working on this one at the moment. And this one's for the front. And what I do is I make them into strips. And I can mix all the hair that I want to, like this one I'm mixing now. I've got the white underneath and then I've got a little bit of the colour on top. And if you do it the width of the head from ear to ear, <clears throat> then you can cut it where you need it if you need to. So this piece here oops, will go across the front like that from ear to ear. And then when that's on, then you can bring this back and um, and... I might need to pull that back up a little bit like that. And you don't get to see any joins or anything. So that piece will go on. But then the, the back section is this that I've laid several layers. Mixing in the colours. And that piece sits on the back. Now I've, I've put the eye in, glued them in. You'll see on the first video, part of the video. And then I've glued that back in. Now this will go from there to there. Do you see like that? And then the next one will fit across there and the next one will fit across there and then the front one goes on and we pull it back and then you can do what you like with the hair. Right, so I think what I'm going to do now um, is to pop on this section of the dress. 
which is what I wanted to do in the first place and I'm only just going to glue it so hopefully you can see what I'm doing I'm just going to follow the line that up around the neck oh I get it right we just have to take it around the neckline at the back here oh what's that doing like that I think I'll just round this off yeah so we've got that and then this has to fit on there Right, just let me help her sit down. Okay, so hopefully you can see what I'm doing. Can you see her? Yeah. And then we have to fit this along here. Like that. So I'm basically only going to glue on the sides here. For now. Ah, hopefully I can get that on there. Like that. That's it, and that helps that stand up, you see. And I can pull that down when I'm doing the hair. And yeah. She's gonna look great, isn't she? I was going to colour it, but you know, I don't think I will. I don't think I will. Let me just cut this. Right. Yeah, I think that'll do that. I like that. Now, let me just see. Because there's that piece as well. No, that's going to affect her hair. Oh, we can put that as a thing at the back. Let's have a look. Waste of time putting these on, really. No, don't like it. I like that. But like I said, we do need to have... Um, no. Not that. Let me just see. Do we need something like that there? Oh, I like that. Now that looks nice, doesn't it? Phew, I'm going to do it. I'm going to do that. I think we need to turn that around, Fee. Turn it around. There, like that. That's it. Yes. See, I like that. And we can still see this netting underneath. Need to scrape that bit of glue out. That's it. Uh, yeah, I like that. I think that looks nice. Oh, she's going to look groovy, isn't she? Cool. Let's have a look with some hair on. 
So her hair's going to be like that. She'll have a pelt there. Which I'm going to glue on. I'm going to glue on. Now, this is going to have to hold up. Is it not with the hair? That's the first pelt on. Right, okay. Now, hmm. I've got to get this one on next, which is the front line one. It's got to be on just right. Okay. I'm going to go with that line. Okay, let's do it. Just put that on. And when we pull her hair back, see? We can sort all of that out. See, like that. like that yeah so now what I need to do is just to fill this in now what I'm going to do with that I'm not going to use that piece I think what I'll do is I'll just fill it in with the loose stuff on the hair Now I'm just going to put a little small layer there, but I'm going to use this one, I think, because it's got some more of the colour in. I think I'll just snip off some of this that I need. Right, like that. So, that's her hair. And then I'm just going to pin this down. Oh, she's lost an earring again. I don't know where it's gone. We'll have to get another one. I'll take that off her ears there. Right, now we can flip her hair back. What I'm going to do is separate it like that and then twist like that.
dot of glue while it's twisted fix it on again while this is twisted oh, miss that while it's twisted fix it on and we need to pull this back so I'm just going to put a dab of glue here and kind of like pull some of this back see like that put a dab of glue in there just a touch and just lift that up and put it in like that so then what we do is I'm just going to take the white because she's got a lot of mixed hair in there oh we've not finished with it yet I'm just going to take quite a bit of this in fact I'll take what's left actually And it's quite long this bit. Like that. I'm just going to take this pelt, uh, what was left on the pelt. Now, <laughs> really tricky but just dob your glue in here there and everywhere right and then this is what I do you can do it totally different so I it's sealed it all together I cut the top off like that and then I glue that bit into the top here and I'm going to push it in there like that and then we just, just let that dry you can keep adding hair however you like and I know it's probably not a conventional way other people do it but that's okay I'm just going to put a dot of glue underneath like that twist that piece of hair and hang that over and then flatten that down see so she's got that I'm going to put another piece here so I need to get another one which is that's too white I think it's that one maybe not this one yeah this one I think yeah and just do the same thing so I'll do that again you take so much I'm going to do quite a bit take all of that off like that there's another piece and get it all together like that dob your glue in here, there and everywhere pull it together like that never mind that bit doesn't matter not quite got it right just put a bit more on and seal it in together and then I just trim the top take the glue Just going to poke it in here like that and then I'm just going to twist and we're going to twist a 
dab of glue in there. And we sit that on like that. Now we can bring that down a little bit. By bringing those two together. And making it look as one. But because she's a wild child. <laughs> she is a wild child. Right. Just twist. I want to twist that a little bit more. And push that underneath. I mean, I'm not even doing this neatly because I don't. I don't want it neat. It's not supposed to be neat. This is my my doll. Right. Take that off your eyelashes, mate. But I've got the crown, which is this one. You can get it off. And she's going to have that crown sit there, like that. So I'm now going to put that crown on. And we're just going to sit that crown in there, like that. Now, I need that pulling back a little bit. So... In order to do that, you pop some glue in the hair, in there. And then you're going to have to... Or what I'm going to have to do is hold that in. That's it. And that's held that up where I want it. See? So she's quite... Um, I like a wild hair. I just like the hair wild. We can titivate it up and make it look a bit nicer. <laughs> 